All right, hello everyone, and happy market day. Um, oops, game's still freezing up a little bit. There we go. Whew. And we've also got Abby's lovely little room here with her lovely little lampster. Good morning, dear. How are you? Oh. Thanks. That's the best breakfast you could have given me. Aww. Okay. Now, today I have to go to the market, dear, so... That's where I have to go. So I'll see you later. Have you come later to buy some stuff? I mean, not that you really need to buy anything. It's, it's kind of yours whenever you want it, but... You know. Just gonna sell everything for now. You don't sell everything, but sell the most important things. I know it's literally the opposite of wood, but shush. Shush you. Shush, random person who's not saying anything and Probably won't be saying anything. Ah, good. A second lot of wine done right now. Beautiful. Good to see it happen. Thank you twice distilled. Let's put it back in there, see how high it goes. No, no. Alright, let's go to the market. We'll take the rest of the wine out. We'll take some other things as well. And I guess we'll just go. Set up the market. Oh god, the nameless clones are here. Looks like I'm still in the same place. Looks like not much has changed in terms of what we've got around us. That's okay. So we'll just put some of these things out. There we go. A nice selection. A nice balanced selection of wares, you know? Perfect. Now, while we're waiting, let's have a look what else is around here. Hmm. Ooh. That's, I think it's a magnet ring. I think we've already got one. Uh, what have we got here? Some squid. Got some cake. Nothing intra too interesting, but what are these things? Guess we'll find out in a little bit. Also, doggo! Hi, doggo. Aww. This is something else there I haven't seen before either. Right, let's see what these are. Globes. Okay. It's hard to tell from this far out. I probably should zoom back in since I've made it bigger. Please, jams. Yeah, small magnet ring. That's what I thought it was. Nothing too crazy here. Alright, I guess we just, uh... Yeah, wait now. Realistically, there's not much point in making the... If I if I don't make it larger, it's smaller. Then I'll be able to see all the stuff as it goes up and pick up anything I want. Carolyn's already manning her shop at least. That's good. Yeah, Marin manning his shop, so you, they can man their shops. Oh, Rose has also got a shop there. Gotcha. Ah, oh, she's the saloony scarf. Yeah, that makes sense. Ah, thank you for making it slightly easier to see what I'm doing. I feel like that mod has been installed just to bother me. But anyway. I mean, I installed it, so... Yeah, usually I'd be a little bit more concerned about the fact that no one has bought anything of mine, but... I think at the moment, um, I'm not too concerned. Because it always seems like I get the last laugh. I just need to wait for more people to get there. Ooh, large fish tank. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Both of them decided to buy something. Thank you very much for your patronage. Good seeing you, Al. Hope you're having a good day. I am. Congratulations, Al. Hope you find your marriage profitable. Excuse me. 
It's your daughter you're, we're talking about here. It's buying an endless number of those. Hey, how are you? I hope Juliet's enjoying a day off. She needs to find herself for a chance. Oh, hey, go hey, Miss Ginger. Believe this if I told you sooner. Yeah. Ask Leah to do a photo shoot on the beach. It's going to be so fun. You can't see Leah in her teeny. Nice. Ah, those kids. They were quite hell racers. Really rather not talk about them. I've got a happy place to retreat, retreat to be alone. Bench by the community center is mine. Wow. Oops. Sorry. I hope Abby does come in. She was one of my best best purchases of wine. Not really. She bought a couple of them, but she was still very good. She was, it's good to have her support. Everyone loves the wine, so come on, go get it. Yes, my goods are rather expensive, aren't they? Alright, oh, guys, you need to buy to see what I've got next. Oh, Crystallarium. Cool. There's goat milk over there. Oh, Floor, what do you have to say about my marriage? Nothing, surprisingly. Hmm. Oh, Torts is here. Yay. Now, obviously, the wine selling comes first because it's the most. Hi, Torts. Do you have anything to say to me? Keep buying ancient fruit wines, everyone. Apples, too expensive, huh. Mean. I have some cheaping things. Ooh, there's some... Lots, there's uh, lots of new stuff just put on the thing. Nothing fantastic. Oh god, all my wine is going. All my stuff is going. Oh god, put the wines on. Like, the thing is, they're not restocking their store as fast as I am, so... If they were, they'd definitely be selling more than I am. Oh wow, Demetrius and... yeah, thank you both. What's Abby coming in? I hope she's not still... I, I would have thought I would have installed enough mods that would make her not be a robot once we got married. If not, i got to check if there's any more spouse mods because... No. There's duck feather there. Well, nothing but alcohol again. That's what we come to every week. Laveral, you're not allowed to buy that. Pretty sure Laverell shouldn't be buying my... Yeah, I think she just did. Laverell, why is it... Why is it... Why... Um, appreciate the business. I feel like you shouldn't be the one buying that. Chicken. How is Charlie going around buying stuff? The chicken's just like, huh, there's nothing here. Annoying. I wanted to spend some money. gonna hide behind the bush and keep putting wine up on the table and see who buys it. 
I'm single-handedly the reason for Pelican Town's alcoholism problem. Which is saying something, given that Sophia hasn't even had a store in town since I started selling wine. Maybe she's just given up. Maybe she's just like, well, I can't win now. Oh, Apples, you're in town. Where the lids on go? You find old sharp sticks? Well, even if Abby was to come in, she probably wouldn't buy from my store. Not now she's get stuff at home for free. See, I could have sold all these wines, like, in the in the shipping bin. But I feel like this is definitely a lot more um, profitable. And I think I definitely need a lot more barrels of wine. Oat oh, kegs. I might see if I can buy one of those really expensive ones. One of those big ass ones from Robin. Not today, however, because as you know, this day is mostly focused on selling. Ooh, Charlie, are you going to buy some wine? I feel like the chicken probably shouldn't. Thoughts? I should really get into cooking more as well, because then I could sell the cooked foods. That's a good point. I should try and cook in a selection of food. For next uh, market day. How hard could it be? I got plenty of um, ingredients coming in. Okay. I've got to get something else out. Sell. Let's try and empty this chest first. Yeah. I have a lot of random stuff I need to sell. Did Charlie just enter Pierre's and leave again? Okay, I assume so. Um, also, all my stuff is now, now sold. So... There you go, guys. Now that the, now the booze is gone, the fresh fruit and veg is out. Which I'm sure I probably won't sell as well, to be honest. Ah! You're selling urchins too! Well, they wouldn't buy your urchins, they certainly didn't buy mine. Oh, they're closed. Are we gonna open this market later? I wonder if I could do that. Like, just in general, what would happen if I was like, actually, wait, no, I want to be open for a little bit longer? Would it? It probably wouldn't work, right? It would have to be like next day. Okay, no, the other market day. Market day. Closing time. Let's say it goes all the way to. Let's say it's a night market. It goes all the way to ten o'clock. It opens up at 6, because who's ever seen a market that hasn't opened up that early? Yep, 
it's back open again. Huh. Okay then. That's uh, very direct. It's a late night market, guys. Come on in. I don't. Wa I've got too much stuff to sell and not enough time to sell it in. In real life, the markets would open up really early. Oh hi. Um, silly. I can't help but notice that you're out in public. The whole point was that you weren't meant to be seen by everyone, and now you're just coming out into. Okay. The only thing it would change is I'd make it so that you can put stuff in that chest that persists over the week. Because that way you can have have your first lots in there when you first start in the morning. Aww. I mean, I feel like I've been making a lot of progress too. Hey, wow, even the, yeah, even the downtown, Zo um, downtown Zuzu people have been coming. I'm still waiting for the Emperor and Empress to come. I mean, no, I don't really take any days off. Well, I guess technically this is out. <laughs> Nest eggs. So, my name, my farm. My name. Eggs, the favorite thing. They're all capitalized. That's funny. Yeah, I know. Gotta love that ghost cabbage. Wow, yeah. People really like to come out to the night market. I should have had this night market idea ages ago. Yeah, I was probably just like, what? why didn't you tell us that we've got more stuff? Or maybe you wouldn't. I like this night market, uh, this market idea. It's a really good idea. Look, I'm standing here. I've been standing here for all day. You, you, you're the one who's coming in and randomly being there. Look, I'm here trying to make my, my living by selling stuff. Apparently no one wants these giant red things. I mean, I'm selling a lot. That's the most important thing. These last few hours have been very profitable. But there's definitely less people at night. Now, I'm not sure how the slime's getting away with this. Who the hell are you, David? Heh. <laughs> 
<laughs> Shane is the mayor. No, no, it definitely is Shane. Like Morris is the mayor. Like, no, we didn't go down the evil path. Okay, looks like we're actually closed now. Alright, that worked. Wait, Wizard's Tower? I have another event in the Wizard's Tower? I mean, I might as well go there on my way back home, but what could that be about? Oh yeah, Morgan. I probably don't need to bother with her at the moment. Let's... Go. Ah, yes. Yeah, that's that's how solar panels work. If you bang them hard enough, they'll just peacefully come off. Hello, Abby. What's up? Hey, little guy. How's David going? Oh, hey, I was just spending it through the time with David Jr. He's saying that's my other guinea pig. He's still chilling in my old room. Why didn't you bring your new guinea pig over? Your old guinea pig. Ah, don't worry. Gives me a reason to keep going back regularly. One that's not saying hi to my parents. He likes that room a lot. So basically, it's became the guinea pig um, thing. I mean, I'm also allergic to, to cats, so... Aww. Aww. You buy a pufferfish? You buy huge parrots? Also, you said years ago, but you definitely look the same age. Remember, Abby, no cats. Your father's allergic. Pets in a box? This is horrible. Right, right, I know. Ooh, a pupfish? Hmm. We have birds here. Hmm. I'd go for the birds. <gasps> the tiny friends. Aww. Hey, little guy. So cute. Hmm. Why is he alone? Aren't guinea pig social animals? His last one, all his sisters in the litter cell sold. Female giving things is quite popular right now, so no one wants the poor boy. That's so sad. But, but, that, but, today's your lucky day. Aww. Can I hold him? Aww. Yeah, now, don't forget our deal, Abby. This is a cat. Let her pay for the cage and supplies. When I return, you'll have to help her around the house. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got it. Aww. Squeak. Aww. But yeah, I'm glad that my parents are okay. He's part of the family too. Then why the hell isn't he here? Ah, uh, fair enough. Good idea. You're sleeping very high on the bed tonight.
Good morning, David. Good morning, dear. All right. Who's the hardest person to farm? If you guess yourself, you're wrong. Love work goes into producing those yummy scrambled eggs that you have for breakfast. Still putting by the shipping chief 50G. On average, it takes 24 and 26 hours for a hen to produce and lay a single egg, with 20 of those hours spent developing its shell. After the hen lays an egg, they only have a 50-minute break before their, wait their work starts over again, with most hens laying upwards of 300 eggs a year. Aww. Good job, hens. Best mark in the world! Yay! Yeah, oh, 180 there, 185. Now, didn't sell any wine to people who wasn't meant to, right? Mm. Apples, why are you. You are literally. Okay. I guess you're not literally fruit, that's just your name, but still. Aspen, Emily. Wow, Aspen is really going up with the wine. It's like, oh, what's another bottle? Oh, wow. I got some starfruit wine. Lovely. Hmm, it's like a phantom male in there somewhere. I should put this wine here. Not that I'm going to sit, not that I'm not going to, you know. I'm not going to use it in there, but still. Alright, so. Hmm. Interesting. Well, let's try some far some some cooking then as well. Let's see. We've got some algae soup. Let's see some green algae, which I'm sure I got some of somewhere. Um, don't know which chest it would be. Probably one of the um the mining chests, I'd imagine. There's a fiddlehead. I would have some algae shortly. Wrong colour, but I'm sure I would have some, right? There's some seaweed. I guess it could be in the fish or the, or the spare fish section. I doubt. Uh, no, there is. Okay, see, where's the seaweed? Green algae, white algae. Alright, let's also take out some of these spare fish as well. Take out some of these. There we go. Now, I can start off by just making a little bit of simple algae soup. So, do I just put the algae there and cook? Yep, there we go. Lovely, did I make it? I did indeed. Lovely. Now, the problem is, I'm not actually sure how the plates work anymore, because I thought that was based on the, um, the kitchen I had. But uh, does that mean I can only cook one ingredient things at the moment? Okay, potato. There's potatoes. Let's try cooking these baked potatoes. And let's cook a bunch of them. Five of them. Okay, that didn't sound good. But no, it is. It is indeed. Okay. Okay, let's see, um, auto add ingredients, there we go. Yeah, green beans, I can make a couple of those, bean hot pots, or one. Yeah, everything I make, I'm probably going to have to, um, sell one of, at least, for the sales thing. Ooh, I can make some bread. Probably only need one bread, to be honest. I assume my numbers, well, I think we'll have to go up over time. I turned off the upgradable um, equipment because it didn't work properly. Do we have anything else in cook with this one ingredient? Or am I just making nothing but... Potato. Okay, pale broth. Let's make a ton of that then. 
There we go. Cool. Now, let's go put some of these in the shipping bin. There we go. And put the rest into the market chest for later. Now, besides that, I can probably take out some of these other things and put them around. It does look like most of the stuff will go... Yes, add all this in there. It's fine. That way it will just uh, be easier to cook. Alright. Let's go this way and... Actually, no. Let's go a long way down. Where were we up to last time? Yeah, I've got to bring in some of the eggs as well. So let's go grab the eggs. Let's uh, go crop some farming. Coop items and bring in a bunch of these eggs. Okay, good. Now, I'd like to deposit these eggs. Beautiful. And I'll deposit these eggs. Now, well, another thing I should probably do if I'm going to do this cooking. Hey guys. Ooh, truffles. They're probably good to have as well. Not to mention the maple syrup. I should probably move that in as well. Alright, so. Ooh, good. I've already got a chest next to there. That's fantastic. So that will automatically work. Um... All right, first of all, what's it doing? I was gonna get this stuff and I was gonna put this into this chest here. So there's cheese there, okay. First of all, let's just pick that up, pick these up. This chest is gonna change location to be right here. And then, gonna have this here as well. And yes, I will put these back in there. All right, so let's take some of this milk. Do I not have any goats? Anyway, and we'll put like half of it in there. Any of the small sacks which I won't need as much. There we go. They should all turn to cheese. Now, I can also make some mayonnaise. So I've got to make a mayonnaise maker or two. At least one mayonnaise maker, although I think I have one inside get that one instead because I won't need them in great detail it can take a while to do this stuff oil maker as well may not be a terrible idea slime hardwood in a gold bar I can probably do that right now so we've got slime hardwood in a gold bar there's hardwood there's slime and then there's a gold bar. Fantastic. One oil maker. Which I will for now put here because then I can just shove the truffles in here. And it'll do its part. Now, let's go get the... I know, right guys? I need to go buy goat though, apparently. I don't have anything. I don't eat goats. Hey, Abby. Right now, the rest of this milk can go in here. There we go. Now, uh, mayonnaise maker, you. Come with me. Oh, you're automatically may making eggs in the mayonnaise anyway. But I'd rather you only make the eggs I want you to turn to mayonnaise. It's a mayonnaise. Thank you very much. There we go. Perfect. Great idea. All right. Fantastic. Um, we should also get the maple syrup from there. Beautiful. I wonder how much cooking I can make in uh, one day. Cooking progress I can make. Probably not too much, purely because... There we go. Recipes ready to cook. That's much more useful. Alright. Ooh, I can just cook a fried egg right out the bat. Fantastic. Beautiful. 
and hash browns. Lovely. And sashimi. Beautiful. Tortilla. Which is actually probably stuff I should make a bunch of and then put in my chest again. So let's do that. Oh cool, it's even got, a, it's even got a unique uh, animation. Very nice. Well that is more of a cooking ingredient, so I'll leave that there. Oh wow, so is that. Okay. Fair enough. Alright, so that's all I can cook right now. Because I don't have any other plates. So, here's hoping I get more when I level up again. I don't think they'll be worth very much at market, so... I will need to get more fridges though. Hello! Actually, no, we need to talk to Marnie and see if I can get some goats. Because apparently I don't have any goats. Hey, I'm wondering, can I buy a goat? I shall call him... Innocent. There we go, because that way if he does something wrong, I can turn to him and say, Don't look at him, he's innocent! And I'll know full well that he isn't. Now, I should also get myself... It was Rabbit's foot. That I need, so let's get myself a second rabbit. As well. Perfect. Oh, affection. Hello. Ah, what a lovely morning. Not a cloud in the sky. Ooh, turtle. I think it's time to go to uh, Ginger Island and see what other ingredients we can fish up. Oh, hello. What's going on here? Hello, Gus. What's up? Uh, hello, Al. The view of the Gem Sea is mighty incredible from this height. So, what brings you to Boo Moon Vineyard? That's on my way to the beach. I see, as it's there, Willie's on the fishing on the rock right now. I bought five cases of premium really in quantity wine from Sophia. The saloon only had one bottle left. I thought it'd be a good idea to restock. Hey, you know we do wine now. Lumen Vineyard is one of the largest vineyards in all of Ferngill Republic. It was the first a few years established many years ago. It always had a great reputation. I don't know much about. It. Yeah, that's right. You don't know. Something very tragic happened to Sophia's parents. I was close to them. They were good people. Sophia inherited the vineyard and she's been doing quite a great job and a lot of work for one person though. She didn't show it up in town very often, not since her parents were. I mean, I feel like this event should have happened a long time ago. Like, she's fine now. Sorry, I guess. That's okay, Al. I need to go talk to sleep tonight. I mean, I feel like that's a weird... Yeah. We should do sort of farmer trade secrets. There's some special ingredients I use to make Blue Moon Vineyard's trademark wine. I mean, you can definitely tell me, yes, I would love that. Because I'm also making wine. Alright. He lied. Willie isn't here. He's in his shop. Excuse me. Now, one thing we've also got to do while we're in Ginger Island is explore more. Beautiful. Oh, 
world, you're still expanding. You're still exploding. With seeds, and lots of different seeds too. Don't now throw those seeds away. In there, but oh, they're all different quality seeds, gotcha. Hmm. Let's just turn a few more into seeds then. And then as for the rest of them, they can go in the market chest for next week. Same with any of the good quality produce. Now, the... I will need some melon seeds, so let's get you on that. And I... Oh, we'll need to plant a bunch of those apparently, so... Oh, well, at least they're dropping their own seeds, that's helpful. Yep, sorry melons, but uh, I'm pumpkining up after you. We need some fresh ingredients. Oh dear, the stuff we're done too. I hadn't even noticed. Oh dear, inventory is full again. Alright, um, just get rid of the crappy flowers, get rid of the- no, I don't need to- okay, never mind. Let's get rid of those, get rid of those, okay. Alright, let's throw a bunch of this stuff into here. Like so. And then let's also start throwing some stuff into these fridges. Alright, I'm guessing I need to definitely get some more chests going on in there. So, um, but I definitely do not have enough space for all this stuff. There's a little bit more, so that's good. Alright, pull it all out. I can sell some of it anyway. Okay, now those ghost roots definitely need to... I don't know how these ancient seeds ever went extinct, honestly. There's so many of them. Oh no, all those other star fruit are coming, coming good soon. Alright, let's just throw these crappy star fruit in to get them changed. We'll throw the good star fruit in for either that or into community chest for later winage. Uh, you know, I'm just running out of space everywhere. Alright, let's put the rest of these crappy ghost cabbages and these ghost berries in here. Okay, you're redoable, so you don't need to go in there. You guys, however, do. Lovely, and put the rest of it in here. I don't know where I'm putting all this stuff, to be honest. I need more space for all these bloody crops. All right, now, more importantly, I might as well sell one, but that's what my plan was. My plan was to go here and check if there are any star fruit or melon seeds. There's melons, so I'll re I will replant melons down here. A little bit of crop rotation never hurt anyone. Except if they were underneath the uh, harvester at the time. Oh, that's actually a full cauliflower, not a ghost cauliflower. My mistake, I'm sorry. You know how cauliflower have very, um, very serious feelings and you don't want to break a cauliflower's feelings. Alright, uh, there we go. Hi. Put these seeds back in here for now. Along with all this other crap stuff and stuff. Okay, so. Good, you're going well. Um, let's also check out Queen, see what his new quest is. If he's got another quest to go into the... Into the Skull Cavern, that would be good. Oh. Four prismatic shards? Well, that's easy enough.
Thank you, friend. All right. Good. Get a galaxy soul. Probably should get a galaxy soul. Or get deconstructed. That'd be fun, especially with the automatic. Oh god, that would be cool. Actually, that'd be really cool. I could just have a chest next to. Okay. I think the best thing right now is Galaxy Soul. We will need multiple of those. Still no trailer bite. I mean, not trailer bite. Um, oh wait, there could be one here. Snake um, phone. Nope. Get away from me. 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 You're not a snake phone. You're not a snake phone. No. No. I know it's useless to try and run away from those things, but still. Hello! Alright, let's go up here and start. Ooh, good. Things are looking good here. Alright, let's go some. No trailer bite. Still, more bloody things I don't need. Come on, I think I'm getting every single one of these things except for what I need. I know there was an error with um, some of these that made the chances lower, but still, I didn't think it would be this bad. <sighs> well, that's a nice one though, at least. Must be a lucky day to get those again, okay. the strange bun out and put the bones fragments there. That'll help me out. Same with the sap and for the tarot tuber there. I know it's not the right chest for it, but that's okay. Perfect. Okay. Ooh, there's still more. Why is there everything but what I want today? Like, that's really good luck. That's five bloody geodes in one go. Or geode type things. Alright, I also need to look to see if I can find any more. Hidden things. Because it's still meant to be additional pathways and things that I can find to other maps. So far, I've only found a couple. Hmm. Yeah, Ginger Island's map would never re um respawn. Hey, Leo. Would you like a duck feather? Sure, look great in your nest. Mushroom actually is edible. This doesn't look like it will be a very nice thing to eat. Oh wow! Oh, there we go. Something back here that once again is not working very well with the uh, Daisy Nico's texture pack. Obviously, they just had to put a little bit of extra stuff on their own. That's okay. Interesting that that's grass that gives me. Oh, hello. Not fog, not now. Oh. 
Trying to explore. Ooh, there's a bird over there. Can't go that way. Okay, go for here. Then can I go up here? Hi, bird. Can't do anything with that then. There's a... Okay. Hmm. Oh. Wait, I'm not done exploring this area yet. That plane hasn't. Huh. Interesting. There's slimes. Are they actually attacking me? I'm certainly trying, but no more than anything else. Hmm. I think this mod has promise, even if it is a little bit, uh, jank. I do like the idea of there being hidden areas of, uh, ginger. But so far, it feels like it's a bit half-cooked. Same with that... Same with that damn mod. You know that damn mod? Like, it's not a bad idea. It just needs something more to it. Like some storyline or an NPC or something to make you be interested and able to explore it, you know? Instead, we're seeing a bunch of stuff which doesn't seem to lead or do any lead anywhere or do anything. Which is interesting. It feels like more of a less of a hmm. it feels a bit like it's actually a um a teaser to something bigger. Just empty spaces for the sake of empty spaces. Which I'm not like I don't think it's a bad thing. But if I need to remove some mods for some reason, if I was trying to do the opposite of this and cull mods, I would definitely cull this pretty damn quickly. It's like I didn't even get any more artifact slots. Like, you could argue that, hey, the artifact slots you get at the moment are worth it. They're really good artifact slots. Like, so if, if basically, if this was giving me artifact slots, it would probably actually be worth it. Uh, no. It's too late. I can't do much around here at the moment. Now, what I can do is try to go to sleep. And, um, I know it's horrible not to be home for my wife, but, uh, she'll manage. She's a big girl. I think maybe tomorrow is when things recycle, and if not, well, at least there's a bunch of star fruit here, which I'm guessing will probably be on the next day anyway. Alright, I can do some other stuff. That's good. Quick breakfast. Nice. Lobster bake, loaded potato, stuffed potato. Okay, good, good. Good, 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 good. Your progress has been saved. Best mark in the world. Fantastic. Ugh. No. You don't need that. Alright. And no one would. You know, don't need religions shoved down our throats. We're having, we're living a beautiful, perfect life. Now, 
well, at least it shouldn't take too long to deal with this. I do admit, it's funny to get the tractor mod and then not actually farming on my farm. Now, I know there's a way you can get more crops as well, like many mods for that. And one of them looked interesting, but it had so many sub-type mods, and last time I tried to get it to work, it just didn't work. So I'm not really sure if it's worth it. Like, PPPJ or whatever? Like, I don't know, should I try it again? I mean, not really... Yeah. I think I want to wait till 1.6. There, there's a few things there that just like, yeah, they feel like they might be a bit of a risk for my save. And I know I've got 259 mods, but uh, sometimes you never know, do you? a little bit earlier but that's okay I trust your ability to make seeds pretty damn quickly we make them fast and I can um, plant them to be honest if you can't well let's look at some more star flute to harvest down there C74, and I think it was 71 before. So yes, indeed, you can definitely make them fast than I can. And then plant them. It's fine, so long as you've got enough of them. Which you should. Yep, 74, 72, so that's obviously the opposite, but still. It's within the margin of error that you're making as many as I can plant as I plant. So I think I've pretty much got the perfect amount of um, seed makers for this job. Obviously some areas be easier or harder to do, but that's okay. 69, okay, that's a little bit, a little bit faster, but I think that's probably because I'm a little bit less moving about to get here. I'm just going in one singular line. Which is a little bit harder to fully screw up. And then there's a bunch of different... Like, one of them, for example, added carrots. And I'm like, but I've already got carrots. Like, is that... Okay, like, how does that work? Does it... Does it somehow work out those duplicates and be like, well, you've already got a carrot crop, so we're not going to put a carrot crop. Or is everyone else's crop so unique that that's an outlier? There we go. Beautiful. Once again, I could just fill this up with, with uh, fertilizer. I probably should fill this up with fertilizer. All I need to do... Yeah, but it's, eh, it's not really, really worth it. I've got a system. It's not perfect, but it'll do. Beautiful. I had just enough. And we've got plenty of star fruit ready to be turned into it as well. Beautiful. No, not the shipping bin. No, 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 not the shipping bin. All right, now, star fruit wise, we shall put some in the mini chest, and we'll put some in the um, 
other chest, the the wine chest. After after we got that there, after we go back to the wine chest, because we'll have to go back at some point soon. All right, nothing. Still nothing. Still nothing. God. Oh, hello, Leo. What's up? Any time? Hmm. Wait. <laughs> oh, Leo, my name's Linus. Oh, all about you and your parent family. It's really something special. Hi, lad. Linus lives on the mainland with the rest of us. After hearing your story, I want to help. So I said Linus here and hatch a little plan. Go on, Linus, tell him. Leo, I'd like you to come back with us to Stardew Valley. It's a beautiful place. Not as warm as here, but it's still full of life. I live right in the middle of it. I know the lay of the land and many things about the waters, the trees, the animals, and much more. You'll see, I'm a child of nature too. You might say we're birds of a feather, but I'm getting old. Now I'd like to teach someone all I've learned before moving on. Leo, will you come back with us? Leave the island? I can take you back for a visit any time. But lad, you can't live here forever. You know there are other children back home too. I'm sure they'd love to meet you. Other kids? What do you think, Al? I mean, I think it's up to Leo. I, I go, I'll go. <laughs> Yay. But my family. <laughs> he says, she says, the parrots are all happy for me, and they want me to start the next chapter of my life wherever it may lead. Aww. And no matter what happens, they'll always be my family forever. Aww. Goodbye. Aww. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Little town, have you seen how many people are there? There's a lot, okay? Uh Alright, let's let's keep going. We've got we've got bones to bone. I've got a bone to pick with you. No, trilobite, please, please, just trilobite me. Ugh. I got a lot of rest on the trip here. Now I'm ready to relax some. Well, I have to go hug my wife. <laughs> Forgot it was raining. Good to see you, Al. Hope you're having a good day. Yeah, it's a good day to go to, um, to Ginger Island, to be sure. Oh, it didn't know it was storming. That's right. <laughs> Not sure where I'd find that many dust spirits, but oh well. I don't really feel like doing that right now. It's something we can do at some point, though, but not now. Also, also. Chico's still drinking too. She's. Alright. I wonder what this golden key is. Is 
been here this whole time. Hey, Robin's shop at 9 to 4. Okay, let's go do that. Because I, I do have to go to the Robin's and see if there's anything else I can buy. Because, like, I've got a lot of money in burning a hole in my pocket right now. Don't worry, 750 wood should be enough. But I think we should rethink the stone in you know, our nation. We should plan for 15% more, just in case the shipment has too many defects. You're right. Joja Mining isn't known for their quality or their punctuality. We should look for another trader. Yeah, someone reliable. And skilled. And fast. And local. Hi, guys! What's up? Ow. Perfect timing. Can we if you in a business opportunity? Uh, Robin, sorry, Al. We didn't mean to jump you like that. You know, we're unhappy with the current supply of stone, so we were thinking... Maybe if you can cram into your schedule, you'd assist be interested in assisting us. In 100 stones, deadline would be 14 days. Um, well, obviously I can get that to you right now. I could literally give it to you right now. Um... I, I could literally just get it out of my inventory and just hand it to you. I think the only thing that that um av avri that that thing is missing, right? This this um avi person is missing, is I really think that would be so much better if the change if the change they're talking about would actually be things that would impact the town, like upgrades and stuff. I think that would be good. Like, I want to see some changes based on what I'm doing to help them. I think that would be very cool. Now, we could do that. I could actually do that. 5 iridium buff, 20, 20 iron bars. 5 iridium, 20 iron. I probably don't have enough, to be honest. Yeah, I got, I've almost got enough. I have to make some more coal stuff. So that is something I should definitely look into at some point. What I really want is this, which is large keg, iron bar, and oak resin. So, iron bar. Oak resin. But a lot of wood. I'd like you to build me one of these. Not paint, sorry. I'd like you to actually create me one. Possible inside there, but I'm guessing not, right? Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to maybe put them, I think, in the new area. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's we'll put them all up here. All right. Well, apparently she can't actually do it now. Unlike the other thing, which is all instantaneous. So I better keep the rest of this on me so I can make more of them as we go along. Also, let's buy a boatload of mini fridges. Perfect. Um, could buy a new double red bed for um I could make a double get a double red bed hmm tempting 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 oh well cool just a, a small purchase of 46 free fridges I'm just hiding for the rain on this tree everything looks so gloomy yeah take some stuff for it me? Wow, really? I love it. How you going, Leo? Indeed. I should buy another ruby ring. Just a chance, I'm thinking. Let's just put the old ruby ring on. Alright, 
silly. I need to give you a star fruit as well. Because I really need you to like me. To really, really like me. So we can move on your quest as well. Okay, cool. You're at full hearts. Fantastic. So does that mean we can actually continue? Will I get a letter in anything? Alright. Alright, nothing here yet. Must be tomorrow, I guess. Hmm, maybe we should also check the farmhouse volunteer as usual, medical clinic, Robin's shop at 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. again. Wait, what? There's a second? There's another event in Robin's house? Robin shop? Yes, there is. Okay. He says, wonderful work with you, the best. Robin's right. Not a single defective one. And it was also perfect. You saved us so much time work with your delivery. Hey, yeah, any time. Ooh, here we go. Oh. I mean, I guess it's a thought that counts. I mean, it's definitely more than valuable than the 100 stones, but yeah. Look, you just tell me what to do and maybe upgrade those those uh, sprinklers to prismatic and we'll, we'll have a nice day. It's inside forest at 5 to 8. Well, that's something then. I think I'll see if Lavril's in the museum again, I suppose. We've only got a few minutes to do so, but that's okay, I can teleport across there. Is Lavril going to be in there? No. Okay, well that, that gets rid of that idea. Oh god, there's so much. East Scarp Sea Cave. Scorping with... Okay, now I've changed the ruby ring I have. Is that enough to have the event trigger? Okay, what if I drop the ring and pick it up again? What if I hand you the ring? Can't do that. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Well, to two. I had an event there as well. I need to go back to that as well. Hmm. So the rest of them, though, is pretty self explanatory, so nothing you can really do. Oh, yeah, I'm waiting for it. Oh, well, we can go back to our, 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 our farm through this uh, little trap door. Actually, hold up. Yeah, Lavril. You're welcome. If you don't cast actual magic while we're, while we're walking together, that would be very upsetting. Nope, too far. There we go. Wait a second. What's that? That's uh, the other side, the um, same area. Gotcha. Alright. I should probably reset my magic ability to see if it actually does anything to reset it. How much does it all suck to be done with, with the way of my magic? Realistically, I shouldn't lose the spells, I'll just lose all the mana bar, so. And I'll do combat tomorrow. Whether I should or not, I can always go get combat back pretty easily, let's be honest. Oh yes, I've also got to go to the wizard's tower to meet the new student. Who are you? I'm like, I have nothing against them, I just, yeah. Nice to meet you, Al. My name is Morgan. I left home to come sell you under Magnus Morismodius. I just rather would think with the, 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 I was the, look what I can do.
Morgan. Sorry, Magnus. I just want to show Al the new magic I learned. There are rules, Morgan. I expect you to follow them. Okay. Go and study chapter two. Ancient fruit algorithm almanac in your room. We'll be brewing potions tomorrow. Uh, okay. I have to go read now. Bye, I guess. Apologies, Al. Morgan has to learn about control. Hm. I have more materials to prepare for tomorrow's lessons. You may stay if you wish. Now I've actually got to check if my uh, if my fruit are done myself. But you talking about fruit reminded me that I've also got some ancient fruit that I will need to tend to now and then. Oh yes. Oh yes, 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 yes. Yeah, technically this for every single greenhouse they have access to with ancient fruit. Probably not a bad idea given that I'm about to get this uh, new... Now one thing I am curious about though is will these solid foundations things work with automate mod? Because if they don't then there may be little point in using them. I mean, there is. I can stand there and put stuff in there like a billion times over. But, I mean, it's okay if they don't collect, I suppose, but no, I don't know. Okay, let's see what happens if I put a chest, just say, this fridge next to it. Okay, that's, that's fair. It is definitely not a place for a fridge. I, I can get that. That's fine. Um, what if I was to instead get some wood? go let's add some wood and build a singular chest like so now if i put a chest like right here it does not pick it up although it has its own chest that's interesting then that's fine that's that's interesting all right um kind of useless to have this but i'll just put it right there how are these things going oh they're done they're invisible cucumbers i'm glad they have finally been uh harvested and ready uh i guess technically i've got to go put them in the seed maker so i can get more right i mean technically this first harvest i should just turn the entire batch into uh yeah okay uh yeah, well it's good to know that um vincent didn't rip me off I'll be a man outstanding in my field yet. On the plus side, at least I should be getting a boatload of batteries pretty soon, because all of them should collect automatically through this chest, I would imagine. There's only a couple of mean hit, actually. It's annoying. Right, well, they're still going currently, but let's take the invisible green seeds out. Right, now, we'll sell one. We'll sell the rest of these Asian fruit. Although, good to turn them seeds, too. Now, I think that's, a, that's like for the next lot. For now, let's go put all this in the chest. There we go. Beautiful. I could. All done. Beautiful. Now let's see if we have enough to plan up the whole field. Let's go make sure we visit their stop more often then, because if they've got all this stuff.
I find it hilarious that this is a thing. I also want to be very careful not to leave any spare spaces for it, because you literally can't see anything. I guess this is like the lowest quality, like the lowest bar on skill, you, or artistic skill anyway, you need to make a mod, right? Like even I could make this. <laughs> Granted, I don't have the programming skill either, but like assuming if I did, you know? All right. Whew. Hey dear, oh, you okay? Actually, just wanted to make sure you're okay. Let's go in here. Aww. Good job, parrots. Also, spreading weeds have caused damage to my farm. Don't like that. They better not have touched my invisible crops. Actually, I, it's probably worse, to be honest. I have a lot of chests. Beautiful. Oh. Okay, that was a little bit weird for a bit. Hello. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I'll be fine. Don't worry, dear. Wait, what does the festival on today? Yeah. Oh, egg already? No, it's Zuzu block party again. Dear Al, thank you again for completing work on Zone. Indeed. Now, where was this problem? This these problem weeds. I'll just clear off whatever weeds I see. Now, I clearly see that those have been collected. How many did we even get? Or not? They're still working on them. Really, the yesterday storm was terrible. Oh, it went there. Even though they're not directly touching still. Okay. Interesting choice. Oh, I don't like having such a small magic bar. I hope it doesn't take me too long to get back up. Ah, you know, it's fine. I'll just keep using it as usual. For now though, let's also do my my combat, because oh. so why wouldn't we? Hey Krovis. How we make how are we not maxed out yet, Krovis? I feel like we really should be maxed out by this point, Krobus. Nice to see the daffodils again. Yes, indeed. Hmm. 
really annoyed about that. Also annoyed that I do not have the fishing power and I need to get more fishing. Yep, technically I could just get an easy fishing mod, but that feels like a bit of a cheat. And a lot of things I do are already pretty damn powerful. Hello! Good job, Abby. <laughs> Al, are you okay? Just a little bit paralyzed, I'm fine. It's okay, dear. Thank you. I've never taken life before. There's no other option, I'm sorry. <laughs> no idea. I can look after myself and clearly you can too. Last time I went to Zuzu Block Party, I had some difficulties getting out of it though, so I'm not sure I'm really embracing to do that right now. I think instead, um, I really would like to do this, which means until I can do that, I might as well fish. Also, while I'm here as well, I should probably also check out if. S silly, silly has any events that I need to see. Maybe that's what it will wait on now that I've got the four hearts. Maybe it's a specific event I need to be waiting for. Silly. There you go. Silly. Events. Nope, not till eight. Oh well. Guess it's mine for a bit until the, the thing's open. Not mine, um, fish. Up and notice the XP bar, what's not there? I was like, did I accidentally press it? Very possible. Okay, it's back now. And we can probably do some more fish cooking as well, see if that if leveling up my cooking has actually done anything. And I've still got like 50 uh 50 bloody fridges to put down. So we've got a lot of things we need to do, really. Now, technically, what's the, what's the wild bait thing here? Fiber, bug meat, slime. I probably got plenty of that, to be honest. Fiber, bug meat, this is slime. Fiber, there's some fiber. There's some bug meat. Need some more slime though. I do not have enough of Silly's friends and family. Why doesn't Silly love me? Ah, there we go. There's some more of Silly's friends and family.
Realistically, I'm guessing this will be all over the place, to be honest. Yeah, see, it's all over the place. It's fine. This is one that's just a little bit. Yeah, pure of that. I think the um, problem won't be the uh, slime meat, it'll be the. Yes. It'll be the bugs. The slime chunks won't be my issue at all by the looks of it. I'm not surprised there are anything in that chest. Alright, cool. So, not perfect, apparently, but we can get a boatload more of that, which is good. And I can put the rest back in the um, crafting section here put them all together so we can find them. All right, then this should technically help with this. In fact, we also do have a treasure or a battle forage with a little bit of this. That should also help. Curiosity lure, having lure in general should help. What a lovely day for some fishing. Actually, you know what? I should also get Elliot to come with me when I go on a fishing journey. Or oh, maybe not Elliot. There might even be someone better. If I could ask some of those, um, that mining mining family. Hey, Aspen. Oh, hello. Oh, yay. Miss Penny, the cover for my math book. Let me see. Oh, no, your books are falling apart. They're just too old. But new books are expensive, so we'll just let me do with what we have. Does that mean I don't have to do my homework? <laughs> oh, she just went in and didn't help. That's not nice. Oh, oh, are all the kids going to community center? Is everyone going to community center? I mean, at the moment we're nothing, because you know. House always seems so weirdly out of place. Anyway, that's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to go see if I could. Yeah, uh, yes, yes, I do actually. Really? Hi. Hey, Dean. Alright, would you come with me on an adventure? Well, if you, you know, damn, plus if you would. Alright, well, how about Elliot? You're locked. It's locked, so he's not in there. No, it's funny because you know it, it, I've got the key, which has to get in everywhere. Apparently, it's not there. Interesting enough. Elliot. Hmm. Let's have a look at the map. Oh, Elliot's... No, that's Julia. It's not Elliot. Um, Elliot is in his beach house. It was, for some reason, I can't actually see him. Unless he's outside his beach house now. Which he wasn't before, but it did look like he was close to being outside. You are outside. Okay. 
Elliot, come with me. But Elliot, Elliot, Elliot. It's, oh, it's because it's... Of course it's not going to work today because it's bloody Zuzu Block Party. So I can't actually go anywhere today. Damn it, that's a shame. It's okay, I had it. Spare. Honestly though, at least this, um, me wasting my time trying to find Elliot to help fish with me is, uh, sort of led to, more importantly, the time being up. You know what, Lance? No! You're definitely not getting that. There is absolutely no chance in hell you getting the Galaxy Soul. Oh, is it closed? Damn. Lance like, yes, if you don't mind, I'll definitely take that one, the one in a kind soul. Well, three of a kind soul, you need to upgrade your galaxy sword. Yes, fantastic idea. Beautiful. You know what? I'm going to go and kill some people before my combat level goes down to nothing. And then I'll have to kill some people after my combat level goes up. I mean, realistically, I probably shouldn't bother with this. Yeah, I probably shouldn't. Let's just do that tomorrow. What I'll do instead is I'll set up all those bloody refrigerators. Right, fridges. This is how everyone's kitchen looks, right? I don't even think they need them to be fridges. That's the worst part of all. Like, they could literally be anything. It wouldn't really matter if they're fridges or chests, I don't think. Well, at least it really does mean I will have plenty of room. Um. Yep, this is how MasterChef wo works, right? I'm sure Abby won't get too annoyed when she can't get into the kitchen at all. Like, once again, this is how, this is how kitchens and storage rooms and stuff are... Lay down, right? <laughs> Alright, more importantly. Let's get some food out to put in said fridges. There's no point having all these fridges if I don't even have any food to put in them. So ironically enough, I'm actually going to go to this perfectly good sorted crops thing, which I apparently didn't use very much. I'm just going to take all my crops... all of my crops and shove them in here. Not specifically mini fridge 26 either. It's just for the record, not specifically there. A lovely soft crackle. There we go. Oh, I think I need some wood for some recipes too, don't I? All right. Nope, so can I do one? Hmm. You guys gotta keep cooking, maybe. I could definitely make a lot of these. Okay, it didn't really help that much. I 
Like a billion baked potatoes, I suppose? I, I don't know. Uh, what's happening? Oh, because I moved in there when I was doing that. Okay. Well, that won't help me either. None of this stuff will help me. It's all I can make, huh? Just make a billion portions of sashimi. This is how the master chef works, right? <sighs> this isn't helping. This isn't helping at all. Let me just Google something for a second here. Joy of cooking. Sardines. Now, how do we get more than one bloody chest? More than one bloody plate? Let's see. Cooking is being rewritten. Built from the ground up to give you more immersion. Blah, 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 blah. Yes, that's, that's fine. But. Level of bonuses for the mod. Okay, you'll find what you get. Okay, load your farm friend on this. Maybe it's just still broken. Maybe literally because I still. Even though I disabled the, 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 the thing, it's still not going to work. I have, there has been a few mods since then. It is possible if I re-enable that in the Joys of Cooking mod. Like, it's also still broken. That's, that's true too. Ah, love of cooking cannot be edited here. Gotcha. Hmm. Hmm. Actually, that's a good point. Maybe I can change the, um, the, the fishing issue here. Ah, uh, here we go. Base fishing multiplier. That'll do. All right. That doesn't help my cooking situation though, so I might have to look it up and see what's happening. Now I think I did still have Didn't I still have the thing somewhere even after I removed it? Maybe it's gonna go to Clint's tomorrow and check it out. I think I might just do that instead. Let's just have an early morning so we can check out Clint's. And I'm also gonna have to go kill a bunch of monsters tomorrow because otherwise I am gonna be very weak now with no magic and uh, no. No monsters.
Oh dear. Yes, indeed. Oh wait, did I just completely break up the... No, I didn't. Okay. Hey, Stark. Good boy. Alright. Now, first of all. Beach at 8pm. 8, 8 hmm. I would feel like it's a little bit, yeah. Oh well, at least we'll go and see if we can find if we can do some fishing today. Very important. Um, and also, I need to see if I can upgrade my my uh, fit my thing because apparently, even though I turned it off, it might still be impacting me because I've only got one slot for cooking. Got a potion in her hands? Oh, hey Al. I'm just relaxing out here, trying to enjoy myself. Okay. I've never been married, no. Come with me, which is a shame, because you'd be a good fisherman to have with me as well. Ah, Elliot. Wanna come with me, Elliot? Like if anyone's gonna help me fishing, it'll be you. At level eight fishing, I might actually have a chance of catching that razor trout. So, if not, hmm. yeah, I could also buy some stuff from Willie, but you're already getting ahead of me. Yeah, yeah, I see how it is. Don't worry, we got double fishing experience now. That should make a big difference, right? Which means yes, I should spend some time fishing first. That's a good point to bring up. Right. Um, sorry, Elliot, I didn't mean to. Sorry, I got overly excited there. Ah, here we go, perfect. You should try and hit for the, uh, the bubbles, Elliot. You'd find it work a lot better. Well, that was easy. Oh, I missed the bubbles. Oh, well, thanks, Elliot. With you here, I feel like it's a lot easier to fish. I feel like three fishing is huge. And with the double fish, that should really help too. God, the minnows, the minnows and the carps, like, we're not exactly getting the world's largest haul here, are we, mate? Well, at least the XP difference does seem to be making a big difference. Sorry, but getting it to level 10 once was enough. Like, I feel like trying to do it again is just terrible. What I could do is I could specifically go and hire some fisher or buy some fisherman's lunch or something from. No, I think I need to be a high fishing level in general. Ah, 
Oh wow, good job with largemouth mouse bass. Oh, that's a that's a good fish there you got there. All I've been catching is carp. Maybe you're the one who knows the secret. Hey Linus, what's up? See, you also know to move move occasionally. I don't bother with that. So, you know, I, maybe there's a reason I'm only getting nothing but carp. But you know what they say, carpe diem, seize the fish. That's what that means, right? For as much as I hate fishing in in Stardew, just because of how much time it takes to do stuff, and it's probably the only reason. Like I don't actually mind fishing um, normally. I'm not that bad at, it. but with how slow it levels up, honestly. Because like most things, right? Like fishing has to provide a lot more XP when you think about it. Because most things, like cutting down trees, you can cut down trees really damn quickly. Mining? You can mine really damn quickly. Fighting? Yeah, of course, you can get like huge swaths of monsters ready to fight you. Like most of these things can be leveled up very quickly, especially when you know what you're doing. But fishing? It's fishing. And you can't even get a really good fish until you're a high level. Like it's just specifically not possible. Yeah, I might as well get this treasure chest anyway. Oh no, never mind. It's gonna be more decisive when it comes to getting these treasure chests. Because I need to get that last bloody artifact. Not to mention I've got to get my points up a little bit so I can actually go and do some stuff of value. Oh, lovely. I'm sure this is exactly what you planned on doing all day, right, Elliot? I will try and get one razor back. Not razor back, um whatever it is I need in here. The bat the, the evil fish that I need to do whatever it is in the forest, which I'm guessing is something to do with Mr. Ginger. I don't know for sure, but you know. Come on, try one more time. You not gonna try fishing down here, Elliot? It's not nearly as scary as you'd think. Either way, I guess I've gotta go and um, 
go to Clint, I suppose. See if I can upgrade my stuff. Hmm. It can drop some... In fact, actually, time is pause. So if I just wait for this to go through... actually drop anything when I'm all of the menu? I don't know. But it's definitely moving through. I think one of my mods wasn't one of my mods better train loot? I don't, I don't know. I don't remember. I think it was. Well, if it is, it didn't drop anything. Oh, wait, no, it did. It dropped a couple of pieces of coal. Which, quite frankly, not a terrible haul. Thank you. Especially for no town um, time used. Alright. Hey, Clint. I'd like to upgrade my flying plan. Okay, I need the copper bars. Here's hoping you actually do it this time, because last time it did not work. Okay, well, it's saying it is. Could also be the auto collect thing, which is doing it, but. Thank you. You keep telling me that. Yeah, take some wood too. I am curious about one thing. So, Elliot. I had fun, but let's, I'll talk to you later. I need to talk to one of these other fishermen, see if they give me more than three fishing points. Damn it, they do not. So some little green cube thingies by the community center the other day. Weird, right? I love how some, some mods make it seem like it's, like, really unlikely that people, like, people, most people don't see it, and then someone else is like, oh, yeah, I saw these weird, and it's like, okay, you saw them then. Anyway. Look, let's just go to... Been drowned. Once again, have a quick look around. It's raining. Good. That means rain birds should be about. I hope. Also means that my poor sprinklers get a break. There's a bird. Amethyst. Amethyst in the west. Also... You didn't think I didn't notice. You, you thought I didn't notice you there, didn't you? Ah, oh, finally. Well, that's good. One last thing I need to come to. One last thing I need to come here for. I just need to trial a bite. I'll be very happy. Here you go. Beautiful. Look at that. With this donation, we've got another full set completed. I got a little something waiting for the counter for you. Wow, look how far we've come. The connection looks fantastic, Alan. It's thanks to you. Here, no way of saying thanks. I want to teach you something. Yay! This device allows you to raise ostriches back at home. Just place the incubator in a barn. Place an ostrich egg inside and wait. Getting your hands on ostrich egg is a different story, though. I'll leave that one up to you. Ha, ah, now the real work begins. Oh well. 
It's about the reward you were talking about. Thank you. Alright. Yeah, can I get two for two and get, um... Get that bloody artifact I'm waiting for? I mean, I'm okay with that too, but... Okay, once again, not a bad haul in general. But I'd really like the trilobite a little bit more. Alright. No. No is the answer. Computer says no, apparently, today. Oh, well, we can put the amethyst here. More importantly though now, we don't actually need to wait for the last stone choice, do we? So, because we now know, Stardew Valley Shrine Ginger Island. Yeah, so realistically, we now know that those are the correct three positions. However, What's left? What are the choice it could be? Okay, so could be aquamarine we've got, ruby we've got, emerald and topaz. Okay. So, it could be an emerald, it could be a topaz. First of all, let's just throw away the crappy stuff. I know I was going to keep this for my fishing, my, my um, cooking, but I'll only keep the good stuff. Alright, so. I'm going to get out an emerald and a topaz. emerald and a topaz. So chances are one of these will be the correct answer. Beautiful. Just what we were looking for. Fantastic. I don't even know what um what ones are left at this point. I don't think there's any farming ones left. Definitely not. There might be some left fighting. Let's go talk to the, um, bird. Ah! Three stuck in shelly Oh, really? There's still some stuck in the shelly stones by the shore? That is actually specifically surprising, because I would have thought there wouldn't be many more of those. Because I found a fair number from there. Okay. All right, well, I guess these shelly stones are due for a cleaning. I might actually stay here tonight as well. Just because. Rain's nice. Okay. 
I thought we were already, we already solved two magic. Yeah, still saving, still going. Ah, beautiful. I should have done one more bit of fishing before I went to. Simple way to tell if an egg's gone bad. Fill a glass of bowl of cold water, then submerge the egg in it. If it falls to the bottom and lays flat on the side, you can still have for breakfast. If it sinks and stands on the bottom, the egg is still safe to eat for it's close to becoming off. And if it's off, you shouldn't eat it. Like it wouldn't taste very good, you might get sick. Now, technically, apparently, that is an urban myth. However, I've also never seen it not work, so... It seems like still a pretty good good way of guess, of, of giving you a sort of an idea of what it would be like, you know? Alright, let's go see if we can get any more of those um, walnuts on the shore. Uh, it takes a few days, apparently. Oh, on the plus side, at least we don't need to worry about the bloody, um... Yeah, we don't need to worry about the snake thing anymore, so we can keep going. Ain't a lot here, though, today. Hi, Lance. Yeah, Lance, I'm not giving you that. There's got to be something better, you, there's something else you'd like. Yeah, no, none of that is stuff I'm going to give you. Okay, actually, all well, chest and chest we probably give you. No, that's an actual treasure chest. Damn. You do have a tomato on you. You like tomatoes, so I'll just give you a liked gift then. Wait. Yeah, it's just a hungry challenge, not a difficulty challenge. That's a shame. See, some of them actually will challenge you to get to a diff to a dungeon on a difficult version of the map, which leads to. Well, hopefully we'll see one day. But not today, apparently. Hmm. No. I still need some more fairy stones. Not trusting the bus ride home. For obvious reasons. Oh. Oh wow, look at this. So this is this is the original um brightness of Stardew Valley. Because obviously this is yeah, close to the old stuff, so it's interesting just how jarring it is in comparison to the um, dull detections. Now that I've been with the dull detections for a while, that's actually quite interesting, quite fascinating. Mm 
Let's go to town. All right, first of all, hey, wait up. Do you like that? Now, let's also get out these things. Let's might as well see if we've got any more fairy stones on us. Oh yeah, never mind. Hey Juliet. Probably the phone thing to be honest. What is smoking? I think that can damage your eyes. Oh hello there. What do we have here? The answer is we have some finished wine. Beautiful. I'm going to take it out the whole lot because this isn't done yet. Huh. That's a surprise. Okay, I thought it might be done by now, but I guess we haven't had three days. It is funny not to see um, Robin just sitting there going bang, 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 hundred times over, you know? Hey Abby, what's up? Just thinking, this farm's so vast and you do a good job caring for it. Very inspiring, babe, I hope you know that. Listen, I think you're going spoiled today, what do you think? Alright, let's go together then. But first, I need to return some stuff, okay? I'll be prepared for market in a couple of days. As you know, my wine is very popular. Let's go, Abby! Onwards! To glory and adventure! Actually, no, I know where we gotta go. Wow. Actually, a little bit of, uh, lag. Probably caused by all the grass, to be honest. Yeah. It's not that bad, anyway. I just want to give it a little bit of clear up. It's okay, it's not too big of a deal. I think the visual mods really do start to weigh things down, but it's still not bad enough. Like, I'm not even near my graphics guy going off or anything, so. She's a little bit laggy in general in here, which is weird. Shouldn't be lagging here. Hmm. It's odd, there's still a little bit of lag. How's this Mappy log going? I'm just fine. Maybe I'm too zoomed in? Too zoomed, zoomed out? How oh, well, that seems to have done it. Alright, so Abby, um, I've just set my skills back to zero, so... I'm gonna need to rely on you too. Like, not just... Not just anything either, just my magic and... My combat, so... I've still got my, my, my sword, so we should be fine, but just to warn you, okay, dear? Yeah, it's okay. I know you're, you're tough. Brave. I'll give you the first eel we find. Now, we can probably get some spells casted, so these things will probably still work. 
There we go. Oh yeah, they're exploding. Useful, useful. Really need then is get one of these bosses and just get you to Oh dear. Hey, you got the eel, dear. Wait, hold up. Here you go. I know you do. I know you do. Oh shit, my health is really low. Um, yep. Uh, can you just protect me for a second? I just... I really need to get to my inventory and get out something to eat. Um, ooh, I've got that as well. That's a good point. Uh, for now, though, we're going to stick with the mushrooms. So just hold up. Hold them back for a second, dear. Thank you. Good job. Let's go. Uh, here we go. Here's what I was afraid of. Dear, well, not afraid of what I was actually trying to aim for. What I want to do it is I want to get my, I want to get him out more so he can, so my spirit can deal with him. Okay, do it, spirit. You can do it. All right. Just keep it going. Keep it going. Good job, Abby. You're the MVP, Abby. Shit. Al? Easy now, take it slow. Oh, damn it. Al! Oh gosh, you okay? Don't get up too quickly. I'm so glad looking better. better, better. I was serious on edge for a while, waiting for Dr. Harvey to let me in the room. You were probably the one who brought me back, I'd imagine. This shit's much better now. Please be more careful. You know, Al, I'm trained to come stronger like you. One day I won't be able to stand by your side and protect you like you protect me. So until the day comes, please don't go where I can't follow. Don't worry, you were already there. You were there, dear. It's fine. We did go together. Let's go to have a break, shall we? Oh boy. Hey dear, wanna go have a spa? Not sure if you can walk through the uh, mail side. Sure no one would care if you rush through though. Oh, they're having a full little family gathering over there. Okay, I almost accidentally put a, an asteroid on their face, so it's a good thing I didn't have the ability to do so. Uh, Abby, are you sure you should, uh... Hey, it's a work for you, though. Let's swim in the back so no one sees what we're doing behind the water, under the water. Thanks, dear.
<sighs> All right, let's go, dear. feeling I for one I'm feeling a lot better now Whew. hey you don't mind if I catch a fish before we go back home do you I know it's not exactly your thing but uh you know not really my thing either to be honest Oh, we're so, I'm so close to leveling it up, you know? I feel like I'm so close to getting a little bit better. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, Abby. I don't mean to bore you. Look, I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, let's go home. Yeah, it's funny. I still remember the first time we met. No, not, not here, no, I obviously, no, I mean the very first time we met. You, be, you, you, you believe in all this, like, magical stuff, right? Uh, well, what if I told you there are other worlds out there, and other Abigails, and in pretty much every world I marry you, pretty much every world we have a meeting, and, uh, yeah, the very first meeting, our very first meeting, I threw a fish in your face. Now, I know what you're thinking. I don't even like fish. I know, but I didn't realize that at the time. I just want to give you a gift because I thought you were so stunning. So, you know, don't don't think too harshly on me. So, you know, as bad as fish are, you know, I will always think of you when I think about fish. And not in a weird way. Anyway, let's go to bed. I think it's time to finish this episode. So there we go. The first days of married life. I think things went well. And I think we still got a bit to go. There's still new things being introduced. Granted, not as many. And I feel like we've definitely finished a few major mod storylines at this point. However, we're definitely getting there. We're definitely finding things. And uh, yeah, we're definitely having a good time. It is true that eventually we want to, might want to wait for more mod updates before we do things. But at the moment... I think this is good. By the time you watch this, um, I've, I've basically just done all these episodes in a big binge. I've still been adding new mods as I find them, but hell, I don't even know. Maybe 1.6 is out by now. And if it is, well, yay. Anyway, I thank you for joining me today on Stardew Valley. Assuming this thing saves, I'll see you next week, which you just did. There we go. Thank you. Or it's about to, I should say. Yes, 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 yes. It's fine. All right. Thank you all. I'll see you next time on Stardew Valley, where we'll continue with all the mods and see how long this continues to work. It still is, though, so that's good. Um, and I'll see you all next time.